test for Tuesday, November 15th, and this has been released by Giants Today, the Horman Barn set. It's a it's a pack of two barns, cow barn and a horse barn. I'm here on the rock crawl because it's nice and flat and has a big placeable area. And I'm on PC, but this is for all platforms. We'll look at first the horse um, stable, shall we say? Go to animals <clears throat> and horses. And there it is, $199,000. It is uh, 12 slots. Place it anywhere like that. It spins around freely. Uh, does not have any alternate looks to it. It is what it is. Right, so let's talk about the horse barn first. Uh, here is the uh, dialogue. You can tell... Uh, it's up to 12 horses. Holds 12 horses. Uh, daily upkeep is $150 per day and daily income 480. Oh, I see. Daily income from the the uh, solar panels. $480 today a day. I'm not sure if that's changes depending on the difficulty. Um I'm not going to test that. Uh, it would mean setting up three different maps uh or do yeah no <clears throat> uh this is 480 dollars day it could be less could be more <laughs> but it's a little bonus um right so aside from the triggers we have uh, you can open the gate it does not require any water straw and food are the inputs so of course uh, you have all these 12 horses you're going to have to ride and look after and all that kind of thing <clears throat> if we uh, walk around here to the back we have a door here to the back side of the barn the door here or a gate for access all around here now here's the uh, food and straw trigger it's a tad tricky um, so <clears throat> we have went ahead one uh, month as it were slept I have one month uh, one day months and I slept already so I filled it up and I slept so the straw capacity is 3200 and 11,500 for food so they've barely ate anything after a month I have a bale here straw goes in here of course it's filled up immediately because it didn't uh, they didn't use that much straw you don't get any manure though or you know what <clears throat> straw you should get manure mm. let's put down a silo i just thought of it now it's like oh maybe it requires a silo so we're going to Put one over here because I don't want it uh, picking up from the cow barn. Right, let's put it right there. <clears throat> we'll talk about the cow barn in a minute. Uh, what's this? Oh, okay, that's... That's interesting. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Distracted. Um, so, food also goes in here. It's a little tricky with this overhang but it is not impossible i have a trailer here and if you back up you just get the trigger right here so it is possible to tip in without a collision it's pretty close though and um if we go back in there <clears throat> uh, we see the food has filled up again and we're on our way with our horses right and that's and that's it for that. Um, so moving on to the cow barn, pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Uh, automatic water, I'm assuming, because there's nowhere to put the water in, and it doesn't show where to put the water in. Right now, the cow barn. This one's interesting. Animals, cows. There it is. Now with the cow barn, it doesn't spin around freely it goes in north south east west 
uh, orientations so you can only it's it's one of those that only go four different directions just so you know uh, $212,400 to place and uh, it is also 12 slots slurry manure it has its own manure pen as you can see here I have 8,999 liters are ready to pick up after a month <clears throat> water in this is also automatically supplied you can open these gates walk around in here food goes in here we'll show that here's the uh, interaction for buying cows milk is here door opens there's the milk storage uh, this little door opens here all these little gates open and close very interactive does this yes that one even opens whoa <laughs> so lots of little doors and openings and so forth and so on so food food capacity is uh, 60,000 liters and oh let's look at that uh, after a month it has used about a quarter of the food and the straw has went down a tad not much so uh, no worries of it running out um, after a month uh, so plenty uh, plenty of capacity and if we just turn around here there we go it also has a roof but the trigger is fairly generous so you could have a big tipper here if you want it doesn't 60,000 liters isn't a lot of food so as you can see it's already full back up to its 60,000 liters straw um, we're gonna we'll, let's see the straw can go in here <clears throat> straw goes in here we have a uh, bale so there we go straw straw goes there it takes bales so uh, same with the horse barn and we're up to uh, the 38,000 liters there now milk production um, not a lot after a month milk and slurry um, of course there's only 45 cows so they're not going to produce a ton of that but what I'm going to do is we're going to pop ahead another month and we're going to see if uh, loose straw goes in here and then we're going to show you picking up the milk and slurry so we'll see you in a moment right so we've gone ahead a month again and uh, if we take a look our milk and slurry has gone up a tad but still well within well not even I'm going to say a quarter of the uh, capacity uh, after two months so you're going to you, your bank account is going to drain before these things will fill up to capacity so uh, plenty of capacity for milk and slurry <clears throat> as for the straw you can see the the bales if you want to put bales for straw they go in here however if you have loose straw you can put the loose straw here and there we go no problem there for topping up the straw if you have loose straw so bales the bales won't go in here if you try to put a bale here of straw no nada that won't work <clears throat> straw bales go here however we do can try one more thing and that's uh, grass or hay we have some grass bales here well, those should go into the food area we're going to just test that right now let's see do the yes look at that so grass uh, a grass bale will accept here grass or hay as they do see their grass uh, grasses went in so if you want to put bales grass and hay bales they can go in here straw bales go in this area here uh, right now let's get to the uh, there we go <clears throat> let's go see the milk trigger 
and looks like it's good to go and there we go milk trigger milk filling up very good and slurry forward ho right ho and let's see is this slurry trigger going to be difficult no not at all there it is filling up with slurry we may as well test the uh, manure trigger oh did the horses produce manure almost forgot about that we did give them straw did they yes look at that so there's manure so the horse barn take straw I said straw why would it want why would it take straw of course because you do get some manure from it and we'll put our straw here there we go straws filled up manure produced by the horse barn very nice a little bit not a lot you're not going to get a lot but a little bit's not too bad so let's uh where's our there we go let's get this guy dump this grain out and one last test for the um manure pile there to make sure we can collect manure from uh <clears throat> from that built-in manure spot there on that cow barn so this is uh you don't see often uh animal barns released from giants so this is kind of i think this is because of the platinum expansion release today uh, kind of going along with that although it's not it was it's just an just a little different um kind of a little surprised to see that al along with along with the platinum expansion uh so there you go look at that it's filling up quite nicely and there we go all good to go no extra uh no a bonus income from the cow barn it uh, at least none is mentioned and there's no solar panels on the roofs of this and there you have it that's the horman barn set by giant software 18.99 megabytes to download 12 slots each it's a pack of two thank you for watching i'm looney farm guy and remember it's only a game so till next time bye for now